Don't forget to look up at the sky tonight. Every December, as our planet completes its annual journey around the sun, Earth passes through the tail of debris from a mysterious rocky object known as 3200 Phaethon. We don't know exactly what it is. Phaethon's nature is debated, Bill Cook of NASA's Meteoroid Environment Office said in a blog post. It's either a near-Earth asteroid or an extinct comet, sometimes called a rock comet. But we do know that, when the dust and rocky grit from Phaethon hit Earth's atmosphere, it creates a spectacular show, the Geminids meteor shower. This year, the Geminids will be the best meteor shower of the year, according to Cook, since August's proceeds were somewhat outshone by the moon. This year's crescent moon won't rise until the early morning, leaving a dark sky for most of the night. To best see the shooting stars, get away from bright lights as much as possible. The Geminids are visible from most of the world, though the view is better from the northern hemisphere. There'll be good meteor activity starting at about 7.30 p.m. on December 13th going until dawn on December 14th, according to Cook. Peak activity is expected from midnight to 4 a.m. During those hours, there should be about one visible meteor per minute, if conditions are good where you are. If you live somewhere dark, you might also spot a few meteors in the following nights. When you see a meteor, try to trace it backwards, Cook said. If you end up in the constellation Gemini there's a good chance you've seen a Geminid. If you're in a place where a dark sky is hard to come by, you can check out NASA's live stream from the Marshall Space Flight Center in Huntsville, Alabama, starting at sunset.